Good morning to all my awesome friends and family. I'm joining in with Kenya's Decor Corner today. We're doing a spring lantern collab and she is an awesome creator and I just love her and she has such great content over on her channel. Please go over and check her out and see what she is up to. Well, why don't we come and see what Grandma's doing? I hope you also go check out the playlist and see what everybody did for this awesome collab on Spring Lantern Collab, hosted by Kenya Decor Corner. Come on now, let's see what Grandma did. Good morning to all my awesome friends. Guess what time it is? Spring Lantern Collab, hosted by Kenya Decor Corner. And I brought spring into the home. And I know you're not going to believe it, but this was a free post. Everything you see here I've had for some time, they've all been used in prior posts. Nothing in this corner is new. This is my idea of what spring should look like. I brought in all these beautiful silk flowers to make a beautiful spring decor corner. What do you think? Now, you're not going to believe what I have in the lantern itself. I have one of those little bird nests you get at Dollar Tree for a dollar. I put a little bit of a silk plant in there with it and a little bit of moss. That's all it is. And, of course, I've had the lantern a couple of years and it's one of my favorites. And I thought it turned out beautiful. What do you think? All the beautiful spring flowers I've had a few months or several years. This cute little Easter egg in little decor I bought last year after Easter on a giant clearance sale over at Pier 1 Import. I thought it turned out cute. The only thing I've added to it, I add a little mushroom pick just to give a little more color in the greenery. That was it. And of course, I bought this beautiful floral wire butterfly over at uh, Home Goods this year. But it's been in quite a few posts, and it's one of my favorite new pieces I've had this year. And of course, I put down some moss sheets and the butterflies I've had for a couple years and they were from Pier 1 Import and they're really napkin rings. I was so happy how it turned out. What do you think? What was your favorite thing that I used in here? Can you believe this was free? Oh my gosh. You know how grandma is. Repurpose, repurpose, repurpose. All these items you have seen multiple times in the last month. Because I put up a post every single week. Well, I shouldn't say every week. I put one up every day almost. You need to repurpose as much as possible. I was very happy how this turned out. Let me know what you thought. I was so glad when I noticed that Kenya had this challenge coming up. Because I have quite a few lanterns and I need to start joining in on more. I was so happy how this turned out. All the spring flowers. like having a, gore, a garden in my little corner of my kitchen. You can just look over here and see all the beautiful florals. I just love this little corner of my kitchen. Still haven't got any lights put under the cabinet. Causes quite a few shadows, but Grandma will get around to doing it soon, I hope. Well, let me know what you think about this post. And if you're not already following me, maybe you might want to think about doing so. I always have lots of content up on my channel, and you'll always find something new and different. 
I do a lot of fairy gardens, home decor, cleaning, cooking, DIY projects occasionally. Please give me a thumbs up if you like this post. I'm going to put a little a little uh, slideshow at the end if you want to see a few more pictures of what I've done. Hugs and kisses to all of my awesome friends that stayed to the very end. Thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate it so.